Hello and welcome to everybody on Cloud Fitness. So in today's video, we are going to see how we can add a prefix to all columns in Spark Data Frame. So essentially what happens is whenever we have a Spark Data Frame and we want to, you know, change the column name or, you know, for a particular data frame, we want to prefix or postfix a particular value, a particular string to the column names in Spark Data Frame, then we are going to see how we can do that in today's video. So before moving on, do remember to like this video and subscribe to my channel as well. So let's move on to the portal and see how we can actually do this. So guys, this kind of scenario is, as I told you, is very common, right? So for this, I am first trying to read a file uh, from a particular location. I'm just trying to read it in a data frame. If you have been watching my previous video, so you already know, you know, these kind of APIs, spark.read API to read a file. So I have just run this particular cell trying to read the, the content of this particular file into this particular data frame this is what we are trying to do now display df will actually show me the contents of the data frame and that is what we have run just now so we will actually see that you know what do we have in this particular data frame and here we are so we have three columns right uh, as you can see here we have three columns over here now if i want to change the column names now how do i do that right now uh, first of all, if I want to check the column name, so, you know, just, uh, you know, FYI that you can simply use df.columns. Now, if you run this particular cell, now using this df.columns, you will actually be able to get the list of column names in the Spark data frame, whatever data frame you describe over here, df.columns. Now to rename, right, to rename what exactly uh, is the way to do that so here you can actually see right what i am trying to do now here i am simply trying to use a for using the df dot column so now you already know know that this df dot column what does it have it has all the column names right now what i'm trying to do i'm saying that for column name in df.columns, right? For all the columns that you have in this df.columns, what do you do? You take that column name and do an alias. Alias means just, you know, change the name. How do you change the name? If you want to add a prefix, you can simply say my prefix and then you can put the column name, right? So for column name in df.column, so in the first, what will happen this column name is what this column name is dispatching base num right so this uh, particular line what it will do it will go to dispatching base num right and it will add my prefix to this particular name right it will add my underscore prefix underscore with this dispatching base num right this is what it is going to do so you need to make sure that you understand this line. What does it mean? So first what I told you is df.columns. What does it do? It will list out all the column names, right? Now you are going to iterate over this and you are trying to use alias, right? You are trying to use alias to rename the column. How you are going to rename the column? You are going to say my prefix or whatever prefix you want to keep over here. So this is how you can actually name the column. So now once you do that, you will actually see, right, that, uh, you know, you will actually see you have new column names, right? Now, how do you see, the, see that, right? You're going to use either display, you are either going to use show command, right? Always prefer display over show, remember that. Now, if you see what I'm trying to do, I'm saying that take this particular data frame, and select everything, all the column names from here, right? All the column names take from this list. So select all the things from this data frame and show me that, right? Exactly this is what it means. So you can either use this command or you can also use this command number two, which is nothing but from this data frame, just select me everything that you have, right? So this is another command through which you can actually see how your columns have been changed, right? Now, if I run this, you can actually see that my prefix has been added to the first 
column name it has been added to the second column name it has been added to the third column name so this is how you can actually you know rename all the columns as well now remember that there are multiple ways in which you can do that i have shown you one way in which you can rename all the columns of a data frame so thank you so much for being till here but do remember to like share and subscribe to my channel thank you so much for being till here